Welcome to Panther News, and today I have our special guest, Frankie. Frankie, tell us a little bit more about yourself. Well, I'm a senior here at IM Terrell. Um, I'm the captain of our VEX Team 17505B. One thing you mentioned was that you're the captain of 17505B, right? How, how is it that you can, you can like lead your team while at the same time reaching new heights? Um, well, I guess it all started like, I mean, I guess it kind of has to relate to when I was a sophomore. Sophomore year was the very first year Robotic Bikes kicked off for us, and I wasn't captain back then, but but we didn't win at all that year. But something kicked in me that made me want to win. So coming in junior year, I became captain. I stepped up, took that role, and then we made it to state. And then now as a senior, I'm like, I want to go out with a bang. So I was like, I want to make it to the world championship. So that's the goal I have this year. Alrighty. But at the same time, I know since you're a captain, there should be some difficulties or issues among your team. Mm -hmm. And what is one of them that you feel is like delaying your path to worlds? Uh, I would say maybe, uh, maybe we don't get the resources that other schools have. Cause well, we, um, we were supposed to redesign a robot for our upcoming competitions, but we're barely getting to that. And I feel like other schools, you know, they have endless amount of resources. You know, they, they have it at their disposal. We don't, so we kind of got to make do with what we have. So it's just a matter to keep trying, keep trying, and not giving up. One, I know this is going to be an off-topic question, and that is, what is the best robot you have ever seen? Like, it could be from any game, TV show, movie. What is one robot that inspired you? That, that inspired me to build our robots or just just any robot, any that, robot. that I just like? That you just like. Uh, I don't know if this is a robot per se, but um, I'm really into steampunk. And there was a movie a few years ago that, that was called Mortal Engines. And it was like moving like houses and like just big cities. And like, I don't know. Yeah, it was like that. Good. That was like my big thing like I was like dang that's so cool like I don't know yeah the one with the moving states mm -hmm. and they're like they're pretty much running on on coal yeah it was oh, it was so nice I, I wish I could experience that with that in mind what was like what was the first time you experienced any stem related class like what was the first stem class you had that really made you be like this is this is the path I want to take uh, I would say robotics one here at Tarot. Uh, we don't offer that anymore, but it was like we well, it was our freshman year, which wasn't COVID, so we couldn't really do much. But I was really like, um, I liked it. But then also, as soon as we uh, we had the opportunity to come into in person, um, I would say around April May of the end of that year, and then. I was I was in the lab one day and then they were working with robots and I really liked it and I kept doing it and then one of the original seniors so the class, one of them from the class 22 invited me onto the team and then that's how I got introduced into robotics so here I am. And now for my last question, this this is going to be more of a pass pass question, and that is if you had the chance to. Have any memory mm -hmm. from your pa from the past years of of Vex Robotics to being your team right now? Mm -hmm. Who would it be and why? Like it it can be like an old captain or even an old builder. A few moments later. A few inches later. Six and a half hours later. 3.28 a.m. 2,000 years later. One eternity later. Tomorrow. I can't really say per much. Like, they were, they all had, like, their own traits that I, that, like, really helped out. Like, um... 
Yeah, I'm not too sure. They all, they were all like, they all played like big roles. So like, for example, like Itzel, so Leslie's sister, a senior from last year, was really like helpful with documentation, taking pictures, all of that. Um, my, my old captain, so the person who got me introduced, uh, one of the original seniors here, um, they were really like very, they had very good energy. So it kept me like motivated and it helped me like keep pushing. Um, like another senior from last year, uh, Mo Conlon, um, very organized, very um, helpful. Um, yeah, I don't know. They all just had great qualities.